So Sell it from love tight Fell qu'on a besoin On musique qui tous Royalty on a budget again Come on, you guys. I know. Y'all really been liking the royalty on a budget. I'm looking out for y'all pockets. At the same time, I'm kind of not because I'm like giving you guys things that are worth buying, but they're budget friendly. So I'm still kind of looking out for y'all pockets. You feel me? You feel me? We here or not? If it's not shiny, if it's not blingy, if it's not glitter, y'all already know I'm not with it. But how about I got my hands on some dollar glitters so these are dollar glitters that I picked up from the website called superglitters.com so here's some of them right here I ordered a total of 20 of them and bid these are a dollar each yeah and these are cosmetic grade glitters Meaning that they are safe and FDA approved to use for your eyes. Because there's a lot of glitter out there. I could you know, I'm not going to lie. I'm pretty sure Hobby Lobby glitter is not made for the eyes. But I don't really follow rules. I know. It's weird. I'm a teacher, but I don't follow rules. As I said, I got them from the website called superglitters.com. I'll leave the website on the screen. And I'll also leave the website down below. Other people have been saying that they've been having issues accessing that website because that company is pretty small so they only take about 100 orders per day. And since they've been getting so much traffic, they only open up the site for about an hour per day. I didn't have an issue accessing the site. To be honest with you, I think by now they're getting more clout so the website is more open and people are having less issues accessing the site so if you are having issues accessing the site maybe try tuesday nights at nine o'clock that's when i was able to log on and i had no issues accessing the glitters or checking out or anything of that nature most of the glitters that i ordered are cosmetic great you guys already know the tea about that there are other types of glitters that are on the site that are also called polyester i have two examples here of polyester they're bigger than the ultra fine glitters and to be honest with you i really wouldn't recommend putting these on the eyes so if you are ordering make sure you order cosmetic grade but i think i might be a little daredevil and try these out anyway when it comes to the cosmetic grade glitter there's different types of glitter for example there's metallic there's iridescent there's holographic there's prism is it prism yeah, there's Prism, there's Pearlescent, there's Mika. I mainly got holographic glitters and metallic glitters, and I got a couple iridescent glitters as well. The same thing goes with the polyester. There's polyester metallic, polyester pearlescent, polyester iridescent, polyester holographic, and polyester fluorescent. Now, these are the bitty jars. These are the ones that cost about a dollar. It's probably about the size of a quarter. It's a good amount of product in here for a dollar. However, there is a bigger size that they have for $1.25. My biggest regret is not getting the one that is for $1.25. For $1.25, for 25 cents more, you would have got more product. I mean, glitter is gonna last you a long time anyway, but I feel like for the $1.25, you get more bang for your buck. The dollar jars are called bitty jars. These are the ones that cost a dollar. The bigger ones are called mini jars. It's a little confusing, but the mini jar, $1.25, bitty jar, a dollar. When you spend $15 or more on the website, you do pay a flat rate shipping of $6.50. I got 20 and the shipping was dumb fast. Let's get these swatches going and let's get to it.
Balancer, balancer. Posez, posez, posez. Et ben, après, l'on l'autre chambre là. Est-ce qu'elle va So those are all the swatches of all 20 of the glitters. Like the colors are really nice. The iridescent ones are beautiful. The holographic ones are like to die for. I definitely regret not getting the 125 jar. So if I were you, I would definitely suggest getting the $1.25 jar. If you're wondering, the adhesive that I used for the swatches, I just used the e.l.f. glitter glue. Y'all, I picked this up at the Dollar Tree, and I'm pretty sure you could find this online. This is what I used to do the swatches on my hands, and this is honestly what I used to apply glitter on my eyes anyway. And this is what I apply on my clients as well when I am applying glitter to their eyes too. If you don't have a glitter adhesive, clear lash glue works just as fine. It seems as if a lot of you guys via my Snapchat are like, oh my gosh, I wanna use the glitter, but I'm scared, I don't know how to do it. But if y'all want like a run through or talk through on how to apply glitter to your eyes, let me know. Matter of fact, I'm gonna leave a poll up there that you guys could choose. Yes, for a glitter one-on-one, -on -one. no, for a glitter one-on-one. -on -one. Y'all let me know. So my Snapchat fam was the first to definitely know about these glitters. If you're not following me on Snap, all of my social media accounts are going to be down below in the description bar and I'll make sure I put my Snap here somewhere for you guys. They was the first, they saw a couple swatches. So what are y'all missing out on? Follow me on Snap. If you're not part of the royal family, come on. Click the subscribe button down there. Make sure you guys share this video with your friends so that they can get the scoop too on where to get these dollar glitters from, okay? They need to know. The whole world needs to know. Matter of fact, also, if you have been missing out on my previous videos, I'm going to leave them right here so that y'all could, you know, take a trip down memory lane and watch our old videos.